when we think about war, we naturally think about David HaMelech. David HaMelech was both chief and staff of the Israeli army, but he also had a hobby. He was a musician who had a harp. And together with that, he was a composer. And he wrote an entire book of Tehillim, of his poems. And it's so, it's so interesting that it's the same person that is the chief and staff. He's the one who's leading the Jewish people in battle. And he's the one who is writing the, the wonderful Psalms that the greatest saints sing. And you wonder, well, how does that work? And the answer is, it works. That's exactly who we are. That's what we're about. And that a person who sings psalms and just sings psalms is great, but he's got only half the picture. And a person who's a military expert and he has military prowess, that's great, but he's got only half the story. The Jewish people are about both. We wage war, and at the same time, we write psalms. This is what David HaMelech teaches us. And today also, the Jewish people have returned to the land. Once again, we've returned to our stature of yore. Once again, we have soldiers who have great military prowess, and at the same time, write psalms and poetry. And I think that today, everybody, everybody can join the war effort. Some of us militarily, and some of us by joining in with the psalms. Together, they form the complete stature of the Jewish people that win in battle.